Hello, hello, and welcome back to mm, Follow New Vegas. Woo! Uh, we have been deep in Vault 22. Like, man, this this is a this is the biggest like dungeon locale we've dealt with. We spent more time here than we spent in Repcon. We spent I think we're, we spent more time here than we spent in Novak as a whole, if I'm not mistaken. Um. So. We're dealing with spore plants and giant bugs. So let's just be very careful as we move along. There's the stairs to go deeper, an elevator. I just keep carefully exploring. Our friends already ran over here and killed everything in this room. We had a lot of glowing fungus back there. You can make good medicine with that. Mm -hmm. What's in this room? Oh, this is just... A way around a barricade in the hall. Oh, hey, buddy. There we go. Took him out. They definitely seem to be getting tougher. Hang on. So, is there anything else this side of the barricade that was worth looking at? Because I saw that turn off in the hall and that filing cabinet. There we go. Hey. Woke one up that's running around. Well, the friend my friends can take care of that. Anything in here? Microfusion cell optimized vigilant recycler. Cool. You're mine. <laughs> Killer cams is like, look at what your friend did. Concrete wall. Good job, guys. We're a good crew. I can see how if you were less prepared, a lot of mercenaries could die here. Oh, shit. You know, these are probably all of the mercenaries. God, look at their face. Uh -oh. Dude, come, come on. This is a hard locked oh door. Yeah, guys, having fun? What are we attacking? I've had work. Looks like break time's over. You good, Boone? Oh god, is Boone getting infected? We gotta kill him! <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Interlab network. All right, let's download the data. That's the bare minimum we had to do, right? Yeah. Uh, but let's see if we can't find more signs of their friend. Wherever she went. Oh, they're very pretty. The mantises. All those are empty. Okay, so I have to be like, there's no way that's where it ends. And I saw the hole. The hole. Okay. Let's stick to the right this time. We did the left and left. <sighs> oh, wait a second. I wonder if this is the other side of the collapsed tunnel from before. It is. Okay, cool. So this does go deeper already. Cool, cool, cool. So at one point, this is... Whoa. Like over. Take out. Jesus, Arcade. Eager. Clear. This is beautiful. All right, I guess we're just jumping down then. Come 
contact. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. They can spit at us. I wasn't ready for that. Here we go. God, she yeeted it off the... She uprooted it with a punch. Impressive, Veronica. What a shame. All clear. What a shame. Oh my god, these caves are awesome. Dude, this is an awesome vault. We're getting EP. Nuka Cola, Nuka Cola. Got the ambient fog. This is great. Looks like great tone. Good shot, arcade. Okay, this is uh hang on. Okay, this leads back up. Is this where we drop down at? Oh no, this is what? Oh no, this is not the same tunnels from before. Oh, this is the very hard door that I walked by. Okay. Cool. Okay, now we have a way back to the rest of the vault. Is there anything else cool back here? Because, yeah, it looks like there's something down that way. This vault slaps. Hmm. Oh, hey! <gasps> Yo! Hey, took your sweet time. I suppose the NCR sent you. Uh. Yes, Angela Williams asked me to come find you. Uh. She's such a dear. Not like that pompous little Pete and Didn't she for. Cool. But that's neither here nor there. These plants have gotten completely out of control. I've got a plan to deal with them, but I'll need your help. Sounds good. Um. Of course, I'll be glad to help. Good. Meet me on the second level, and I'll explain what needs to be done. You know, I understand the threat that can exist here. Oh, there's a human skull. Can I take it? No? Okay. Oh, wow, she, she's sprinting. She, I guess she was hun hunkered down there trying to stay hidden from all the plants and mantises. Jesus, she's... Ooh, she be running. Running, running, running. I keep on running, running, running. Gonna be running, running, running. God, she's outpaced me. Oh, she's fixed the elevator? This vault tech machinery is so fragile. I had to jury-rig this elevator a few days, and it's on the fritz again already. Ah, that's got it. See you upstairs. Okay, awesome. That's awesome. She fixed the elevator. Ooh. Hang on. Let's see what's down here real quick. Where does this go? The common area. Contact. Aha. Sorry, Veronica. What a shame. All right. It's over. Oh, and <laughs> just barricades. Just a few hidden manti. Ugh. <sighs> 
All right. That's awesome. She gets, oh. All right, oxygen recycling. Uh, and she's gonna be right back by her other bot. No? Where are they? Oh, there she is. Hey. Where's your bot? Oh, I may have looted your duffel bag. I did not loot her duffel bag. Okay. Where'd your robot go? Uh, let, let's talk with her. Good, you're here. Ready to begin? Uh, sure. How can I help? Time is of the essence, so I'll be brief. This place is filled with spores that are toxic to humans, and we need to get rid of them. I've pumped the vault full of a highly flammable gas that, once ignited, should destroy the oh. vast majority of spores. There's one problem, though. The gas becomes semi-inert on exposure to oxygen, meaning the gas will have to be ignited close to where it's being introduced. I need you to find the vents where the gas is being pumped and ignite it. Oh, and survive the resulting blast. Ah, uh, exactly how should I ignite the gas? In the area where the gas is active, any kind of fire or explosion should do the trick. Hell, even lasers would do the job. If you don't have anything like that, I've got some grenades in my bag in the corner that you can use. And about the blast? Yes, there'll be an explosion when the gas is ignited, but I'm sure you'll be fine. Now leave me to my work. Any idea where the vents will be? I set the gas to pump into the fifth level since that's where the concentration of spores was highest. I'd start looking there. Typically, these vaults use circular vents in their air circulation systems. Look for a wall with two of them almost side by side. There's one just around the corner outside this lab if you need an example. You're out of your mind. I'd love to debate you on this, but there's no time. Now do it or don't, but stop wasting my time. <sighs> Sounds dangerous, but I'll do it. Good. Return to me when it's done. All right, where's the example vent? Ah, so it's gonna be space like that on the fifth level. Calculating. Cal calcula calculating. Still just calculating. Jesus. All right, I guess let's go blow ourselves up. Fifth level. All right, let's just comb the walls. Looking for vents like those. There it is. Shit. Hang on. I'm gonna load the autosave rather than go into the death the world thing. Okay, shit. Um. Run, 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 run. Holy shit. Okay, hang on. Let's go up a floor real fast. Wait here. Should have brought something to read. Oh, I'll be here. Just don't expect me to fend off. Okay. I don't have anything I can do to speed myself up, do I?
Yeah, nah, okay. We're gonna have to uh, run fast. We got long fuse dynamite to hold it off as long as possible. Go, go, go. Woo! <laughs> All right, guys. That really could have been a sacrifice yourself for the wasteland moment if you wanted it to be. I've got your back. God, I've saved the wasteland. Just when the standing around. I'm a hero. We did it. I suppose you have questions. Hurry up. And what? I thought I did it. How'd you get this whole gas thing up so quickly? That's a very good question. Actually, I didn't come up with it. The systems were already set to pump the gas when I first arrived here. I believe the scientists were in the process of attempting to ignite the gas just as we're about to do. And by we, I mean you, of course. Did I not do it successfully? Something prevented them from igniting the gas, obviously. I suppose it's possible that the gas triggered some kind of defensive reaction. Hordes of previously slumbering creatures may have awoken and entered a killing frenzy, ripping the hapless scientists into quivering bloody chunks. Jesus. You'll have to let me know when you get back from going downstairs. Um... What are you doing in that cave? The mantises and spore plants virtually ignored me for most of the time I've been here. It was only once I began to investigate the fifth level that my presence began to agitate them. I guess I was a little too close to home for them. A few days ago, I was attacked by a large number of mantises and was knocked unconscious. When I woke up, I was in that cave. The mantises seemed to feed some of their prey to the plants. Fortunately for me, it appears the plants are disinclined to eat ghoul meat. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, well... Later. I must have fucked up. So hang on, let's, um... Load my auto so I don't have to tell everyone to wait again. Quick save. Oh. Oh, is it working now? I just had to go down again and re to get it to re-register or? No, okay. It hasn't. I didn't ignite it successfully. Fuck. God damn it. Woo! Okay, there we go. That time it worked. Huh. All right. Follow. Follow. Lead the way. Follow. Just when the standing around. And follow. I've got your back. All right. Ah, good. You survived. I was beginning to think you hadn't. You'll be pleased to know that the spore should no longer be a problem. Now all that's left is to ensure that none of this ever happens again. The research that led to these abominations must be erased. I don't know about that. I've managed to create a connection to the vault's backup system from here. I just have to remotely delete all the files, and we're done here. Whoa. Will it take long? No, it shouldn't take all that long. Just a few more moments, and that's strange. The system says that the files were accessed recently and copied to an external source. Yeah, I you downloaded them. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? Actually, I copped the fire. It was Hildren sent me to here to get them. Um. Yes, 
Yes, that sounds like something he'd do. Well, there's nothing for it then. Those files need to be erased. Hold out your arm and I'll have it done in a flash. I disagree. No. So you're going to be stubborn about it, eh? You sure I can't change your mind about this? Positive. This... It, just because it went bad here doesn't mean somebody who knows what they're doing couldn't do something good with this. Then you give me no choice. What? No! Looks no! Like it's right time to... Oh my god, Veronica, zero hesitation. Nothing in Keeley's notes. God. Open entrance door. She, she closed the vault door, huh? Oh man, I feel fucking bad. I didn't want to kill her. Well, like, there's no way to, like, talk her down. But, like, I disagree with the scorched earth thing with the research. Just because research does bad in one place doesn't mean it can't be good somewhere else. Like, in World War II, the Japanese, Americans, everybody really did fucking horrible research. But some of that horrible research is now used for great medicine today. We wouldn't have to treat frostbite if it weren't for the Japanese's torture experiments in World War II. And we wouldn't be on the moon if it weren't for Nazi rocket scientists. Science isn't bad, people are bad. I feel bad. I didn't want to kill her. God, Veronica, zero hesitation on your part. That was insane. Well... I hope everybody's enjoyed this episode of Fallout New Vegas. I feel bad we couldn't save her. Really bad. Oh god, that actually like feels terrible. But she chose violence, not me. Hmm. Let's listen to the radio. Ladies and gentlemen, you're listening to me, Mr. New Vegas, and you look extraordinarily beautiful right now. That's the news. This is Mr. New Vegas filling in for Mr. New Vegas. The Helios 1 solar power plant remains dormant despite NCR's effort to reactivate the facility. The chief scientist at the plant vowed to fix the problem blaming it on an atmosphere of, quote, severe underappreciation. This program was brought to you by Gamora. Gamora, it'll be our secret. Got a song for you now. It's about a guy who's cold on the exterior, but deep down, you know, he's a good man. And his name is Johnny Guitar. <laughs> 